Hi, what's up YouTube? In today's video, we're gonna be installing this smart switch. It uses Wi-Fi. This is the box right over here. The side, the back, the specs, the other side. And one thing I like about this setup is you don't need a hub. All you have to do is just wire it properly and it'll work with Alexa and also Google Assistant. So in the box, you get your switch. This is what it looks like on the front. And this is the back with all the wires. Comes with a faceplate. You have your wire nuts. You have some um, wire labels you can put on your outlet. And then this is your instruction manual. All right, so I'm all done about 15 minutes later. This is the uh, Smart Life app that you're able to pair this smart Wi-Fi switch with. So this is what the wiring looks like. I have the live right here, the ground, which goes to the yellow and green one. The red goes to the load, which I labeled that right over there. And the neutral is the white. And of course, the main reason why I bought this Wi-Fi switch was not only to be able to push it on and off manually, but to also be able to push it on the Smart Life app, which is right here. So I just clicked on that and it turned on the patio light. And then I can click on that again and it turns it off. So on, off. So all that's left is to tuck everything back in, put all the wires back in and get the customized faceplate because originally it had this switch right over here and it had this faceplate. So I need the faceplate that looks like this, but it has the big rectangle on the right side. So believe it or not, the hardest part about this project was trying to get all the wires out, organize them, and most importantly, try to tuck them back in neatly so that I can actually put the switch back on. All right, all done about 15 minutes later. I did have to go to the store and buy a new faceplate because the original one came with uh, two toggle switches. I actually needed this one to accommodate this rectangular switch here. But um, definitely whenever you start this thing out, make sure you turn off the power to the breaker and then organize all your wires. And then after you're done, then you can go ahead and program this thing to the uh, Smart Life app um, application on your phone. And so you can be able to click on the uh, switch manually like this, or you can actually go on the app, like I showed you earlier in this video, and turn it on and off. You can even designate a name for it. I just call this patio light, since this is the patio. And then you can also add it to the learning skills on Alexa, and you can tell her to turn it on or off. So I'll give you an example here. Alexa, turn off patio. Okay. So see, she turned it off. So I just wanna show you the Smart Life app. It's right over here. It looks like a little house with a Wi-Fi looking chimney. I can click on that and I can access all my smart devices. I wanna show you right over here to the left corner. This is the switch that I just installed recently. It's the Wi-Fi switch. So I can actually just click on this right over here. It turns on the patio light. I can also go in there and change different settings. So I can change the timer and um, do a schedule on it as well. So you got a lot of options there. And I'm just gonna show you really quick my other smart plugs and other devices. So I can turn on that light over there. That's my tower. And I have another lamp over there. I have as lamp two. So I can click on that and control everything from my phone. And I can even control my TV. So back out of this, I wanna turn on this TV over here. I don't know if you heard it click, but it turns on the TV and I can turn it off here. So really nice device, highly recommend this Wi-Fi switch, which is right over there. Works perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. There we are. And I can even turn on my other smart um, applications like this one right here is the lamp. See that light came on over there. If you all have any questions at all, just comment down in the description below. But please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And as always, thank you all for watching.